They're pressuring you guys a lot on the perimeter, more so than the other games. Do you have that sense? Uh, I feel like they, they pressure me the same every game. Uh, I feel like that's all they can do to stop me. So um, I just want to keep playing tough and uh, keep putting my teammates in the best position. Tell me all well, the one possession games you guys had last year that went the wrong way. How does it feel to deliver in those last seconds? It feels great, man. It's definitely a um, different feeling than losing and winning those games. We come back in here, we pumped up, we excited. Last year, 9 out of 10, we was coming back in here with our heads down. So it definitely means a lot that I'm, that I'm getting a win like this in this tournament. What was the ride over here like? It sounds like you guys had a problem on the bus. Yeah, it was crazy, man. I was actually asleep when the bus started having some malfunctions. Uh, it was rolling backwards like two or three times. But like Coach said, I'm a memory, and thank God we came here and made another one. What was that like? It's, I know you guys have been here for a couple days, but it was like a welcome to New York kind of um, yeah, moment. Yeah, definitely kind of welcome to New York moment when I woke up and it was snowing this morning too. Yesterday it was sunny, so it was like two welcome to New York moments. How much Thanks, does man. momentum play in a tournament like this when you play, you know, two, three, four games in a row? What'd you say? How much overall momentum play? Oh yeah, any um, win is momentum, uh, but you, you don't got to play the game tomorrow. There's going to be a lot of momentum changes tomorrow, so we just want to take this, this, this win and and, and I'm enjoy it, but definitely get ready for tomorrow. Tony, since the Michigan trip, Ohio State. No, for me personally, yeah. Uh, I don't know, probably practice. I don't know. Okay. Uh, yeah, I haven't really. Yeah, it's, it's been a long time, but I'm just. How would you describe that feeling? Like maybe even thinking back to sixth, seventh, eighth grade. Uh, what is that feeling like? Kind of. I'm fortunate that I'm not the one that usually takes those shots, <laughs> but um, uh, just Tony's just just the player that he. The player that Tony is, he's just capable of making those shots, and everybody just draws so much attention to him, and I was just fortunate enough to, to get open. Josh, when you get the ball in that spot, this sort of situation, does mm. the basket get a little smaller? Do you have to really think about getting that ball, even though it's right there? Yeah, I, I, uh, I didn't know where I was when I caught it, so I kind of had to, like, I jumped a little too far, and I kind of like, had to stretch out my arms to try to get the ball uh, into the basket. And uh, I've been in that situation before and the ball kind of like rimmed out because I'd hang on the rim and it would just like lay there but I was fortunate enough to jump high enough to, to get the ball over the rim. Josh, I heard it sounds like you guys had a bit, bit of a crazy bus right over here. What was that like? Uh, uh, I was listening to music. I had no idea what happened. Uh, I just I just saw everybody get up and start looking out the window. <laughs> yeah, was, that's, that's pretty much everything I, I knew about it. Do you have any major takeaway going into tomorrow's game? played three really good games against I think, you know, that... Um, that game winner they hit on us at, uh, at our home last year really sits well with us and it sat with us for a long time over the summer. But we um, attack every game the same way and, um, you know, we were just uh, able to come out with a win against a really good team. Uh, it was amazing. Um, you know, the crowd really got into it, and they re we really fed off of that. So it was huge for us to have such a nice crowd and, you know, for the gym to have so much energy. How big was it for you guys to get going early? Were you a big part of that? Yeah. Um, it was huge for us. You know, we, you know, whenever you can get out into a big lead, you know, uh, a good lead in the first half against a really good team like that, you know, it's really good for our momentum and keep it to keep it going in the second half. So it was it was huge for us. Not only when you these kind of experiences, but just big tournament, big time It means a lot, like just everything I've been practicing for, just coming. So it means a lot though, like just going out there playing a the big stage, playing my heart out, playing for Penn State basketball. It means a lot. Oh yeah, it's a family. So wherever we go, they gonna go. So like they at every game, if they bring the energy for us, make us even play even a little bit, sitting harder on the court. So it, it gave us a bunch of energy that we needed. Uh, just leadership. Just he, he been teaching me stuff like on the court and off the court, but a bunch of like leadership. He a good leader for our team. What's the key to keeping this thing going tomorrow, keeping your legs fresh and, and being ready for the next game? Just go home, get some rest right now. Celebrate this win right now. we we'll go ahead and get this rest and just keep playing the Penn State basketball as we've been playing. Yes, sir.